Well, there's the moon. We're on our way out to Dummerston, Vermont to shoot the covered bridge. And the full moon is coming down, the hunter moon. So Dave, what do you think of this opportunity? We're we gonna get anything to take a picture of? I hope so. It's a long drive, so hopefully it's worth it. <laughs> So this is a pretty neat bridge. We're going to the Dummerston Vermont Bridge. It looks like it has potential. I mean, there's a lot of foliage around there. Hopefully there's some color. Hmm. Yeah, if we're lucky, there's color. Right? Welcome to Vermont. Oh, let's say welcome to Vermont. We made it. <laughs> We're taking the exit to Manchester here off of Route 91. Take exit two toward Rattleboro, Well, we're making our way through Vermont here. Just have to see. <laughs> the West Dummerston Bridge. There it is. 3.3 miles. We're hoping for a little color around the bridge. Let's hope we get some. Ooh, is that it? Oh, that's a that looks like the bridge right there. Well, here's the bridge. This is pretty cool. So here's the shot down here. Got some reflections in the water on these rocks down here. So if I can get myself down this pathway down here, which looks like it might be possible. So I can make my way down here. We might be able to get a shot down here. It's looking kind of promising. Kind of tricky getting down this path here. But there's going to be some interesting photographs here. I can tell you that right now. Thanks for dropping by the channel this week. Um, we're over in West Dummerston at the Covered Bridge. And we're here around sunrise, probably about a half an hour after sunrise. The light's just starting to come over the hills. And we'll see what we get for some interesting color and this bridge in the background is going to be pretty cool. We're going to start looking for compositions with the 1680 on this 63, see what we get. Um, it's a very long bridge, so, uh, you know, getting some of these rocks in the foreground and the whole bridge is not going to happen. So we're going to look around. Got a nice reflection in this pool of water right here. Might be able to get something over here. I'll just take a quick one. Some really nice reflections in these pools here. Gonna really watch my step though. It's really tricky. Watch your step, boy. So I'm gonna set up for some verticals. Maybe if I can get some uh, leaves in the foreground, maybe that might work. We'll just have to see. Being really careful. Us old guys got to watch out what we're doing. We might fall down, you know. So the shot I got set up here is a vertical. We got a nice reflection of the uh, bridge going this way like this. And we've got the bridge, of course, coming back this way. So let's we'll see how it looks. It, it looks pretty good in the viewfinder. Well, here's the shot right here. As you can tell, it's... Uh, the focus in here, and uh, no, nothing up here in the sky, unfortunately. Come on, focus. There's nothing up here on the right-hand side of the sky, unfortunately. Well, unfortunately, for me, this is kind of a nothing burger picture. The uh, right-hand side in the sky is just so empty, and there's not a lot of color in it. Well, here's a horizontal shot of this, and it's, <laughs> it's not great. But, you know, I really like the way that these uh, rocks are going out like this. 
and we've got a nice convergence going on. It looks kind of nice. Uh, we just the only light really is the color on the other side of the the uh, river here. Well, yeah, look for other things. I don't know. There's not a lot of color around, unfortunately. Maybe look for some leaves in the pools. I don't know. Sorry to sound so disappointed, but I drove, we drove two and a half hours for this, or about two hours and 15 minutes. So, unfortunately, I'm not really sure what we're going to get. We've got some nice convergence of these rocks right here and the bridge going that way. Well, for me, actually, this is the best picture of the day. It came out a lot better than I thought it was going to. Light room to the rescue again. Um, but still, the sky is not a lot going on. Well, I found some a little bit of color. We got a vertical shot here with the 7300. The tresses of the bridge are showing through this window up here, and there's some a little bit of color along the side of it. So it's an interesting shot vertically. Um, I kind of like verticals. So you can kind of see the shot here. I'm gonna go up and hopefully the camera will focus. You can see in the middle of the frame there what I'm looking at. Well, this turned out a little bit better than I thought it was going to. The bridge has got a really interesting window there with the trusses th showing through it and a little bit of color. I also started looking around again for other photographs and this one I really like too because we've got some, at least some colorful leaves in the foreground. So this image here of this lone leaf with the tresses showing in the background kind of summed up our day. <laughs> One lone leaf left over from autumn. So at one end of the bridge, there was this very interesting stop sign. Now you have to understand this bridge is only one way, so folks have to stop and let the other traffic from the other side come across. So I thought this was a really interesting photograph of this sign with all these stickers all over it. So thanks so much for watching this video this week. It was a tough one. We came out to West Dummerston, Vermont, and unfortunately, not a lot of color. Beautiful bridge, but just not real scenic this, right at this time of year. Unfortunately, we had a wet, wet summer and unfortunately it just didn't work out. I went down below and got some pictures of uh, some reflections and things and just something a little bit different, just not a lot of color. We got a few colored things here and there, but really not what I was looking for. So if you wouldn't mind, please comment, hit the like button, and most especially, please subscribe to the channel. That would be great. We're up almost around uh, 3,700 or so subscribers. That'd be great if we got more. But that's it for this week, and we'll catch you next time.